This video will demonstrate how to calculate the gradient of a straight line. The general formula for the equation of a straight line is y equals mx plus c. What do these letters mean? The y and the x refer to the two axes on a Cartesian plane, where the x is the horizontal axis and the y is the vertical axis. The c refers to the y-intercept. This is where a line crosses the y-axis. The m refers to gradient. Gradient is the same as slope. These are just a few examples of slope in the real world. Which of these paths would you rather take? I imagine it would be the one on the right, as the one on the left is very steep. This means it has a large gradient, whereas the one on the right is almost flat, which means it has a small gradient. Let's look at how we actually calculate the gradient. To determine the gradient of this hill, we would first need to measure the distance of the vertical rise and the horizontal run. In this case, the vertical rise is 6 centimetres and the horizontal run is 12 centimetres. The formula which we use to calculate gradient is rise over run. We can then substitute the values which we just obtained into this formula. This gives us 6 over 12, which is 0 0.5. Therefore, the gradient of this hill is 0 0.5. Let's look at another example, this time using a triangle as a simplified version of a hill. We again need to measure the distances of the vertical rise and the horizontal run. We can then substitute these values into the formula rise over run, which gives us 6 over 3, which equals 2. Therefore, the gradient of this hill is 2. Now let's look at finding the equation of this straight line. As the line crosses the y-axis at 1, this is the y-intercept. Next, we'll calculate the gradient. To do this, we need to choose two points on the line. These are the two points that I've chosen. We then need to determine the vertical and horizontal distances between these two points. These are otherwise known as the rise and the run. We can see that the vertical distance, or rise, between these two points is 2 centimetres, and the horizontal distance, or the run, is 1 centimetre. We can then substitute these values into the formula for gradient on the right. This gives us 2 over 1, which equals 2. Therefore, the gradient of this line is 2. We can then substitute these values into the equation on the right. This tells us that the equation of this line is y equals 2x plus 1. We now need to practice finding the equation of some straight lines by determining the y-intercept and calculating the gradient.